toe boom connect to the foot bone. The foot bones are the basement of your skeleton. The 22 bones in your foot support the entire weight of your body. A built-in arch helps absorb shock when you walk, run, or jump. Foot bone connect to the ankle bone. Without ankle bones, you wouldn't be able to lift your feet when you walk. Because the ankle bone swivels, it allows the foot to flex so you can climb stairs, run, or dance. Ankle bone connect to the leg bone. The leg bone is actually two bones, the tibia and the fibula. The fibula, the smaller of the two, is located on the little toe side of your leg. You can feel the tibia at the front of your lower leg. It's the one that really hurts when you get kicked in the shin. Leg bone connect to the knee bone. The knee bone, also known as the kneecap or patella, covers and protects the knee joint. The knee joint works like a hinge on a door so you can kick, jump, squat, and dance. Knee bone connected to the thigh bone. The thigh bone, or femur, is the longest and heaviest bone in your body. The top of the femur has a ball joint that moves within a socket in the pelvis. Thigh bone connected to the hip bone. The hip bone, or pelvis, is made up of six bones. Sockets in the pelvis hold the ball joints at the top of the thigh bones. The biggest difference between the male and female skeleton is in the hip bones. The female hip bone is wider and lighter. <laughs> hip bone connected to the back bone. You couldn't stand up straight without your backbone. The backbone, or spinal column, is made up of 24 vertebrae. The last four bones in your backbone form the coccyx, the remnant of a tail. The most important job of the backbone is to protect your spinal cord. Backbone connected to the shoulder bone. Actually made up of a team of three bones, the clavicle, scapula, and the top of the humerus. The shoulder bone is the most frequently broken bone among children. The humerus rotates in a ball and socket joint so you can move your arms around. Shoulder bone connected to the neck bone. The neck bone is a continuation of the backbone or spine. It is made up of seven vertebrae called cervical vertebrae. These seven bones in your neck rotate so you can turn your head from side to side, nod yes or no, and wiggle your head in time to music. Neck bone connected to the head bone. The head bone, or skull, is like a box that grows. The skull, which is made up of 29 bones, is about 50% of adult size at birth and continues to grow quickly during the first year of life. Most importantly, the skull protects your brain when you stand on your head. Them bones, them bones, them dry bones. Them bones, them bones, them dry bones. Them bones, them bones, them dry bones. Hear the word of the Lord. Them bones, them bones, them dry bones. Them bones, them bones. Hear the word of the Lord.